Welcome back to Steel City Drones YouTube channel. I'm Dave King. Today we're talking about the CZI GL10 Spotlight for Mavic 3 Enterprise. Now this is pretty much going to be used for the Mavic 3 thermal version of Enterprise. You can use it with the E version Enterprise as well. And we got a lot of requests, you know, at, can you show us some usable data on how well the spotlight works? So we're going to go over the features and functionality first and then go and show you some actual test data. So this is a dual axis gimbal and it is two independent lights, but they will stay in sync with each other. And again, you can be in sync with the actual camera tilt. So as your camera is tilting up and down, your spotlight will stay in sync with it. Now, let's say your point of focus or the actual spotlight is actually a little off center. We have all of the normal trim accessories built into the Pilot app. Again, this is something that you can, is just all incorporated into the Pilot app as far as all the features and functionality. We also have red and blue or a combination of the two LEDs on the front. If you do want everybody on the ground to know, you know basically that this is a police drone, you have that available for you as well. And it did take a little bit of flight time off. I saw test results of right around 26 minutes of flight time when we got this up in the air. So it is gonna go ahead and reduce your flight time a little bit, but again, at 134 grams, you're not gonna find anything lighter than this. Now, this is rated right at 30 watts of power. And again, this is very similar to the same output that you're gonna see on the LP12 loudspeaker spotlight combination on the M30. Now, what I really like about this spotlight over a couple of the other ones that are on the market is that this has the ability to tilt up as much as 70 degrees. So let's say you are using this drone for a bridge inspection and you need your camera and spotlight to go above the horizon as much as 70 degrees, you have that ability to do so. The other ones in the market do not have that ability here. Now, as you can see from the bird's eye drone that's above the Mavic 3 Enterprise, the size of the spotlight is a little smaller than I would like to see. But the size of the beam really doesn't matter when we switch to the zoom camera as the entire light is in full frame with minimal zoom. So the field of view on the spotlight is only 12 and a half degrees. You're not going to get the same kind of results you would using a GL60 Plus with an M300. That's just not going to happen. But again, it's very usable. Now, as we go up to 150 feet high, again, it's bright enough to be very effective. And overall, the effectiveness range, in my opinion, for this light is around 200 feet high. But you also got to take into effect that the thermal camera is also not that effective at three to 400 feet high with a resolution of 640 by 512 with digital zoom only. That's just not going to happen. So I think that overall, this light is engineered well for the specs of the thermal camera limitations on there. So from an overall design standpoint, I think that the compromise has been well balanced between the size and the weight of the payload limitations versus what you know is effective for normal operations. So that's everything about this light. So if you have any more questions, put them down in the comment section below. We have this light on our website for sale. If you have any questions, again, give us a call if you need to, and we'll be glad to help you. And if you haven't yet, please help us grow the channel. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and also hit the notification bell so that when new video content comes out like this, you'll be among the first to be able to see it. So thanks again for watching. We'll talk to you soon. Steel City Drone Flight Academy offers the most comprehensive on-site commercial remote pilot training program in the United States. Our team of professional drone instructors has more than 30 years of combined experience and have trained more than 1,000 students to fly drones commercially. We offer on-site training anywhere in the United States. 
Dave King from Steel City Drones is a pioneer in the drone industry and is one of the most experienced remote pilots with more than 18,000 logged flights and over 10 years of flying experience. After working with more than 800 clients, Dave has taken everything that he has learned and incorporated it into Steel City Drones training program to prepare you to be the best commercial pilot possible. Our most popular training package is a four-day commercial program. Day one, it's an introduction to drones day, an introduction to flying day, equipment familiarization. Day two is all day flying. It's our advanced flying. You learn up to 15 different practice exercises. You learn how to fly manually without any automation, and you're gonna be amazed by the things that you can do by the end of the day. The third day is what we call Advanced Ground School. We teach you everything that the Part 107 test does not. And that's gonna be everything, nuts and bolts from a theory standpoint on how to be able to do flight missions. Everything from flight planning, risk assessments, to wireless communications, how to use visual observers, all the resource management from a theory standpoint. If you wanna really sharpen up how to fly drones commercially, and professionally, this is a day that you cannot miss. The fourth day is a commercial applications day where we're taking the first three days, putting it all together, and we're doing simulated training missions that you would normally do for commercial flying. Inspection work, mapping, or they could be search and rescue, monitoring, a lot of different ways that we can go with that tactical day. Depends on who is in the group and what they want to be able to do. They're, they are completely customizable. We also offer everything from one day introduction classes to seven day train the trainer programs tailor made to your specific needs. What sets us apart from other training schools is that we teach you how to fly manually without any automation so that you're prepared to respond to the worst type of situation a pilot can experience. Steel City Drones offers small groups of up to six participants per instructor so that each student gets sufficient one-on-one -on -one instruction. I'm Detective Brent Dukes with Jackson Police Department. Uh, the thing I like most about uh, Steel City Drones on-site training was that from all the way from the setup, the most basic parts of the setup of the drone and the equipment, having an, an expert right there with us to answer any questions we have was so helpful. They offered a comprehensive package including equipment recommendations, training, certification, study guides, everything that we needed to implement this drone and entire department they provided. Uh, some of the training that we got on site was flight planning, um, emergency drone recovery, should the worst case happen, dual flights uh, with two controllers, uh, one operator controlling the drone itself, the other controlling the camera. I would say that as sophisticated of a piece of equipment as this is, it's only as good as the operator who is running it, and the operator is only as good as the training they've received. Um, because there's no way that I would have figured out some of the capabilities of this equipment had I not had uh, David on site as an expert. I'm pretty capable with this type of equipment. I'm, I'm pretty savvy with technology, but there are things that I learned about this because David was there to answer questions in real time that I never would have learned on my own or even with the other uh, members of my department who were flying it with me. If I didn't have his expertise in real time, I, there's just capabilities that I would be completely missing out on. My name is Robert Warrington. I'm the budget analyst at the State Training School in Eldora, Iowa. Uh, working with Dave was fantastic. He gave us great guidance and what to look for and you know, kind of his insights and what would really help for our kind of uh, mission that we have here. And by building this, I think it's gonna help the school accomplish what we're looking for. For more information about Steel City Drones training services, please visit our website at steelcityflightacademy.com.